All right, I got a Christmas present from Relapse Records. It's time for an unveiling. What do you think? I think I need to sharpen my blade. I'm actually trying not to do too much damage here. Why do they keep the record on the outside? Sometimes, usually, I don't know. Anyway. Thousand dollars? Just kidding. You recognize that voice? You y'all fans? This, as you can see, is the whales and leeches by Red Fang. It's their latest. It's, I wish they would do something. There's always something. I want some color on my covers or something. I opted for the gold, metallic gold. I had a feeling that this was going to play a little bit better than the Coke bottle clear. And it does feel a bit heavy. Unlike some of the some of the thinner clear albums I've gotten in the past. But what got me this time was Orion Landau's artwork. Not so much his artwork, uh, because it wasn't quite Seagrave to me, but it was the lenticular cover on this. Yes. you can tell on the video how that's working. I hadn't seen this done before on an album. I was wondering how thick the cover would be. It's, it's not really that much thicker. Now of course Megadeth's new album, Super Collider or whatever it's called, um, has a 3D cover on the CD, but it's not near as interesting as this. Lenticular cover. So, I just had to get this. some decent artwork on the inside and back kind of strange a little slightly disturbing maybe if you thought about it you know it's nothing you haven't seen on National Geographic or something comes with a free poster. It's not free, but comes with a poster. Blown up. Which this will look better far off, I guess. If you're into collages. 
but uh, this will probably never come back out of the album. How sad is that? We'll see. So, Red Fang, Whales, and Leeches. Relapse records. They know that people are. Uh, I'm actually, you know, I got the download and I bought. Paid more than ten dollars for this album, so they got my money. But um, but uh, you know they've got a come up with some new marketing to get people to not do Spotify for everything. It's kind of unfortunate to me because you know, there's already too many starving artists out there. Well, I think that I mean, it's going to be just fine outside. There's no need for bands to be starving. Well, some of them. need to starve enough to know that they don't need to be playing music or what they think is music but uh, anyway yeah this turned out uh, pretty cool interesting to see how this fits in here how well it fits or doesn't takes to get these just right, but it ought to be perfect down to a science by now, huh? Pretty cool. Well done, guys. soon enough on vinyl and see how that sounds. That's the way to go. <laughs> <laughs> 